Hello everyone, welcome to the electrical circuit simulation series. In this session, we will do op-amp as a voltage follower. So this is the circuit diagram we will be doing on Samuel ID. I will explain the components. This is the input, a DC, a DC source we are using as the input. So we can vary the, the input voltage from 0 volt to 5 volt. Then the second component is the op-amp, the operational amplifier. Then we have the voltmeter to measure the output voltage and then the ground to complete the circuit. Now uh, as seen in the op-amp we have two inputs one is the non-inverting input which is given by the plus sign this is connected this is our actual we are, we are applying the input at the non-inverting end with this uh, okay this is DC source and then we are using the negative feedback so uh, the output is connected again to the input at the inverting end so because it is connected at the inverting end it is called as the negative feedback so negative feedback has a uh, advantage that it actually is increases the circuit stability and uh, then uh, this is how actually the circuit will work whatever input as we can see the input is given as 3.65 suppose so we are getting the same output so this uh, circuit is called as a voltage follower because whatever input we are giving okay the input is 3.65 so output is also 3.65 so whatever input voltage we are giving we are getting the output voltage as long as the op-amp is uh, not going into saturation so now let us uh, go for the simulation part which will be do will, will be performing on Samuel ID software so now we are in the Samuel ID software so let us select the components the first is the we select this input power supply sorry not this one uh, this one so the input power supply a variable source okay. then uh, we need op-amp so we get the op-amp from this point here we have this op-amp then we need a ground so here we have the ground then we need a voltmeter this is the voltmeter now this we actually we want to just flip this so that negative comes down and positive goes up this will also work but there is no harm in doing this so we just have a vertical flip so now this is what we have so now let us uh, connect the input so this is the input then uh, this is again returned back to the as of negative feedback we are interested in measuring this in this output voltage and this is connected to ground so this is a very simple connection okay. this is the connection now let us turn it on so now we turn it on and turn on the power supply this is zero let us move this okay so this is 0 0.6 and and actually we are getting zero point this is millivolt actually let us increase it more so now input is 1.12 volt so this is almost 1.1 okay then if we increase this voltage to around 2 2.31 so we are getting almost 2.3 so if the input is uh, uh, 3 volt uh, it is also 3 volt so this is how whatever input we are giving we are getting the same output so this is how the voltage uh, follower works so that's all for this particular session thanks for watching